Hello and welcome to today's Engineering at Home Challenge, sponsored by GE Digital. My name's Tom, and today I'm gonna to show you how to make your very own hologram projector using materials that you can find at home. So what is a hologram? Well, you may have seen holograms before on items such as banknotes and bank cards, and these are used to reduce the risk of counterfeits being produced. Now to create those holograms on those items, what they do is they actually split and stretch recorded light into 3D images using a laser. Now, unfortunately, I don't have a laser in my recycling bin. What we can do is create a holographic effect using a different technique. And the technique that we're going to be using today is something very similar to an old technique known as Pepper's Ghost Effect. And Pepper's Ghost Effect basically takes a 2D image, reflects it onto a surface, which then creates that holographic image. For this project, you will need some clear plastic, some sellotape, scissors, a ruler, super glue, and a pencil. The first step is to create the template for your projector. The measurements I have used are six centimeters, 3.5 centimeters, and one centimeter. But you can make yours smaller or larger depending on the device that you'll be using. The next step is to cut out your template using scissors. Please make sure that you have adult supervision when doing so. Now use your template to cut your plastic. You will need four sides in total to make your projector. The next step is to attach all four sides of your projector together using sellotape. Once all four sides are attached, you can then use super glue to make your projector more secure. Please make sure you have adult supervision when using super glue. To test your projector, you will need a smartphone and of course your projector. And you can find various videos available online that project different holographic images. So once you've found the image that you want, you'll need to go into a dark room, place your projector in the center of your phone screen, press play and you should then see the holographic image appear. So I hope you've enjoyed today's engineering at home challenge. Please remember to share your videos with us using the details appearing on screen now. And also have a look at our other engineering at home challenges which are available on our website. Thank you very much for watching.